Kids work hard on the wrong things and wonder why they're not succeeding. They can't blame the coach, so they blame themselves and give up on baseball. Greg Del Mar, a parent of one of my hitters. According to LittleLeague.org, there are millions of Little Leaguers and hundreds of thousands of softball girls worldwide that are participating in baseball and softball. And these numbers are increasing every year. However, their retention rates of these players sticking to the sport are on the steady decline. Now why? Now argu arguably one of the best hitters ever, Ted Williams, was the last person to hit 400 back in 1941, once said that hitting is the single most difficult thing to do in sport. Now there are a lot of people out there that have opinions on hitting, but opinions are not facts. They are what we call bro science. Now there is a process to finding the truth when the truth doesn't know it's lost. First step in the process that we use is we apply human movement principles that are validated by real science to hitting a ball. For example, physics, biomechanics, engineering. Now, there are hundreds of ways to teach hitting. However, there's only one effective way. Just like we can eat soup with three different utensils, a spoon, a fork, and a knife. But there's only one of those utensils that's gonna be much more effective. Teaching hitting is the same. The next step in the process is we do swing experiments using the scientific method and modern technology such as the hit tracks, ZEP, swing tracker, or blast motion. Now a lot of hitting instructors out there do not like to do swing experiments because they are afraid of what those experiments will turn up and prove their hitting philosophy is wrong. They have too much at stake. The third step in the process is the fact that Video analysis should be second priority. How do we know what we're looking at if we don't know what we're looking for? Video analysis without knowledge of human movement principles validated by real science is like trying to pin the tail on the donkey in the dark. The next step in the process is we use only the best swing models. Now who are those? What's that standard? We ask questions. Who is good? at hitting despite being poorly built for it. Who's good at this? Who shouldn't be? The last step in our process, our filter, our standard for finding the truth, are case studies. We ask questions. Have you trained others to do this? And have they replicated your results? My answers to those two questions is an emphatic yes, we have. Everything hinges on replicatable live case studies. Hi, I'm Joey Myers, founder of the Hitting Performance Lab and author of the Amazon best-selling book in 2017, The Catapult Loading System, How to Teach 100-Pound Hitters to Consistently Drive the Ball 300 Feet. We have helped tens of thousands of coaches help their hundreds of thousands of hitters succeed by applying human movement principles that are validated by real science to hitting a ball. Thank you for watching.